It doesn't take any talent to be a great teammate. It takes no talent to be a great teammate. It takes no talent to think about the team first, to take pride in our role, whatever it is, whether you're team captain, CEO, or whether you're you know, more of the supporting cast. Every role matters. Every role matters. And so I feel that a rising tide lifts all boats every day of the week. There's no way it can't. A rising tide lifts all boats every day of the week. There's no way it can't. There's no harm that can be done by all of us bringing our best every single day. Obviously, I know we're all human. I'm human. We're all human. We got things we're dealing with that may be the reason we don't bring it every single day. But I think if we can consistently show up bring our best to serve others, serve our clients, and add, do our best to add value every single day, the team's going to win. The team's going to win. And so my coach, uh, Laval Jordan, he was an assistant coach when I was there, um, he said, Austin, there's two kinds of people in the world. There's energy givers and energy drainers. If you're not bringing energy to practice every single day, you're draining it just by being there. One person can't make a team. Like in basketball, it takes five on the, on the court playing as one and the bench too. One person can't make an organization, obviously. But I think one person can break it, right? We could bring the whole team down by, bring, by bringing negative energy, feeling sorry for herself, having the victim mindset, right? So I think if we have that team first mentality, we have that, that standard over circumstances. Whatever our circumstances may be, the challenges we're facing, if we remember the team's counting on us to bring it every day, to be the best that we could be every day, I think we'll be much more likely to do that, even in the face of challenges and adversity. So I think having that team first mentality is so important. You know, it applies to everything. Sports, business, marriage. I, I'm learning fatherhood. I mean, I'm new to it. I'm, I'm, I'm 11 days in, um, so I'm, I'm new to it. Um, I'm t yeah, t 12 days in, so, so I'm new to it. But it, it's, it's amazing, the greatest blessing in the world. And my wife has a role has a lot of roles. I have roles as, this, as her supporting cast, right? So everybody has a role, and I think the roles are extremely important. It's kind of like, um, there's a book called The Starbucks Experience. The, and it's about, you know, the, the subtitle of that book is turning ordinary into extraordinary. Turning ordinary into extraordinary, because obviously, you know, Starbucks is a, you know, it's created this global empire um, of, you know, coffee, and I think, you know, there's like 25,000 stores around the world, or whatever there is. Um, chapter two of that book is titled, Everything Matters. Everything matters. And I think in business, in life, in family, whatever it is, everything matters. There are no little things. Because the little things over a long period of time become the big things. And if, if something can make, can have a, a t make a tangible, whether it's tangible or intangible impact on our business, on our team, on our family, it's not little. Maybe doing it once or twice is not that big of a deal, but doing it consistently over a long period of time has an opportunity to create a great competitive advantage. So I think having that team first mentality is so important. And I think we all just got to remember to take pride in our roles every single day, whatever it is, whether you're more of the team captain or more of the supporting cast, every role matters. I feel like we owe it to the team to take pride in our role and make the effort every day to be the best that we can be. So that's grit to me. That's kind of my standard for myself. Everything I do, I'm gonna have some grit. I'm gonna have that. I'm gonna have, be driven by my greater purpose, my, my family in heaven, my wife, and our baby. And what I'm not. There's nothing I won't do for them. There's nothing I won't do for them. When I have that greater purpose, it drives the growth mindset. To always look for the opportunity in every situation. Drive us to make the decision to be resilient. The decision to take massive action in the face of adversity. Because we can. You can go small in the face of adversity. You can. You can decide to do that. We all could, but if we, want to, if we really want to overcome our challenges and achieve our goals despite the challenges, I think we've got to go big. I think we've got to go big. The I, integrity, always be honest, of course. Do the right thing when no one's looking, of course. Go about our business the right way, absolutely. But I think it's especially about following through on our commitments even when our circumstances change. And so doing those common things in an uncommon way consistently. Last letter of grid is T. And T to me is the team versus mentality. Every person here has a role. Every person on every team on the planet has a role. So I feel like we owe it to the team to make the effort to be the best we could be every single day. So that's grit. I think if we have some grit in the face of challenges, in the midst of adversity, in the midst of any circumstance, I feel like our team's going to win. I feel like we're going to win. So thank you so much for the opportunity. I really appreciate it. Thank you.